Hey, babe. Yeah. Come here. No. I'm always looking out for you. Please stop. What size do you wear? Please put what, those what, away. What size do you wear? I got you. If you want these, I got you. Those What's are too big. I'm sorry. What size do you wear? I wear an eight. This is an eight. I got you, fam. Let's go. Um, put them away. That's a steal for 42 bucks. What is good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. And the clip you just watched is a very small portion of the video I uploaded on my other channel, my in real life slash vlog channel. Went out, went shopping. It's a lot of fun. If that looks interesting to you, link is in the description so you can watch it. So in today's video, we're going to be doing two quizzes in one. Both of these quizzes are going to be dealing with NBA players facial features. The first one being NBA players hairlines. Because for some reason, you guys love to talk about hairlines. You see why? I keep this hat on for a reason. And the second one is NBA players' eyes. Now, I did upload a video yesterday that I took down after like 10 minutes. It just... I had to take it down just because it was the worst time with all the drama going on in the 2K community. It was the worst time to upload that type of video. So, for the guys that are looking for the rebuilds and everything, check back tomorrow. We'll be fresh with some more 2K. But for now, we're about to take these quizzes. Alright, so here's the quiz, man. NBA guests this player's hairline it was made by pineapple 4393 again if you want to send me a quiz be sure to do that on twitter or like on this website you can put in the description king uh king of the fourth quarter and i can search that and boom it'll come right up so that's just another way you can do it these quizzes are not meant to be hard rather we're just going to be having some fun talk about hairlines and eyes so let's get into it man 13 questions we should fly through it though the first one being lebron the guy that y'all crucify crucify every time because of his hairline. But lately, he hasn't really been wearing his hairband. I think he's come to come to the fact that, you know what? My hair's going. I'm still the best player in the league. It's fine. It's fine. You can make all the hairline jokes you want about LBJ, but he's still out there making his millions and winning games for his team. Number two, obviously, that is Jeremy Lin. Obviously, that's Jeremy Lin. We, Jeremy Lin is the GOAT when it comes to hairstyle, especially last year. I don't know what he's doing this year because he's been injured for a lot of it. But he went with the cornrows, he went with the spike, he went with the man bun. He was all over the place. And we had this picture with the cornrows. People were going crazy all over Twitter. The guy knows what he's doing with his hair. What we got here? Nerlis Noel, who brought this back to the NBA. I Well, or the Iman Shumper. It was either Iman Shumper or Nerlis Noel. Even I have a cut similar to this. My hair is not that high, but very similar. I like the cut. Nerlis Noel. What we got here? Steve Nash. Easy. Steve Nash hair never moved. I mean, when he cut it, when he was when he was younger, he had the longest hair and it was going everywhere. But once he cut it, his hair stayed the same every play. Dressed in sweat, flying across courts, his hair stayed the same. What we got number five, difficult. That's JaVale McGee. That's not too difficult. Nothing really special about his hairline. What we got? That is Seth Curry. Yeah, nothing special about his hairline. Um, that's Vince Carter. That's Vince Carter. He's been balding for a long time, but then he finally got it all going. And, you know, it, it works. It's worked. I mean, he's 30 plus years old, so it's fine for him to be bald, right? What we got here? I think that is Bismack Biombo. Jason Terry's been bald for a long time. Yeah, that's Bismack Biombo. That's. Oh, God. Cut him some slack, man. Cut him some slack because. J just cut him some slack, all right? What we got here? That is Brandon Ingram. His lineup do be kind of fresh. He's got a unique hairstyle. Everybody's trying to be unique with their hair, and that, that, that's always cool. This is Cal Singler. Now, Cal Singler's hairstyle lately has been really, really weird. I mean, I haven't watched him play much recently, but I know in the beginning of the season, he had like a purge hairstyle. You know, the, those those people that were out trying to kill the poor. He like he was going purging. What we got here? I don't know this guy. Oh, it's wrong? Whoa. See, I thought I was going to get an easy 100%. But Diamond Stone, who hasn't played at all this year for the Clippers, I don't think. I've never seen his hair. I've never really even seen his face until just now. So, I caught that L. Why would I pick that one? He's not even in the NBA yet. I thought maybe it was a quick uh, trick question. Impossible. Hell yeah, it's impossible. It's got... It's a hella pixelated. Um, Sham guy, what? How am I, I'm gonna skip that. This is a bonus. 
Oh my god, that is crazy. The bonus is none other than the king of the fourth quarter with the hair lot. Oh, that's when I first revealed my hair. <laughs> this is hilarious, dude. Yo, I don't know who made this because I didn't see it on Twitter. I just searched it. You are the real goat for this. Oh my god, that's crazy. Let's go back to this one. I think it's Sham Guy. And it, okay, it is Sham Guy. But this. I'm an expert, barber, but this is 100% the greatest thing I've seen since <sighs> Clay Thompson dropped 60. All right, so the second quiz is made by Awesome Face. Shout out to you, bud, buddy, for sending it over my way. Can you guess the NBA player by their eyes? Now, everybody has unique eyes. That's no doubt. But when I'm watching players play basketball, I'm not staring into their eyes. That'll be kind of, you know, that'll be kind of sus, right? But let's see how good I can do. 12 questions. I'm thinking I, I could probably get 10, hopefully. So this one is obviously Steph Curry. Or, oh, he's got jokes. Stephanie Curry, I guess. Number two, this is obviously James Harden from that famous walk away from that interview. Chris Paul, that one's easy. What's so three for three? Not as hard. That's okay. This one's tough. Um, He looks sad. He looks sad. Those are some sad eyes, man. Russell, I've never seen Russell look sad. I've seen him mad. I've seen him furious and stuff like that, but never. I'm going to go with uh, Kyle Lowry. Oh, we're clutch. Four for four. Okay, now this dude's angry. Marcus Smart, Iggy. That feels very Tony Parker. And it is Tony Parker. Five for five. Um, Look at the options. Russell. That's Russell. Yep, okay. Isaiah Thomas. I think that's... It's either Avery Bradley or Giannis. And I'm going Giannis. And that's good. 7 for 7, baby. This one's Dwayne Wade. Derrick Rose. Are we going to get a perfect score on this one? Anthony Davis. Really easy. Yes, that's really easy. Um, Is that LeBron? That is LeBron. 12 for 12. Seth Curry. Booyah. Never looked at these dudes in their eyes ever but yet, yeah, I know them all. So let me know if you did enjoy the video. That first quiz really threw me for a loop when I saw myself with my hairline, which I don't know. I just thought it was cool. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, leave it a like. Be coming back tomorrow. If you're looking for some more 2K, I'm back on the grind with 2K as I'm getting notifications. And also go check out the vlog channel. We've been going crazy on that. We're doing three times a week for Vlogmas. If you don't know what that is. Some people are trying to upload daily vlogs. I can't do that. My life is not nearly as fun to do it every day but three times a week is what we're shooting for and that gives me an excuse to leave outside this room and go shopping or just go chill you feel me so thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you did enjoy it as much as i did doing it um thanks